she needs to clarify or kill this issue somehow, you know, in terms of uh, being able to address that, 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 uh, that question of, did she instruct her legal team to go after Mars McCabe because the, the, the charge essentially is Keelan that you know in public she was saying very nice things about him and lauding him and, and saying that you know whistleblowers have you know a home in the Gar- on Garda Siakona and the perception now is that you know she was saying one thing in public and her legal team were trying to undermine Mars McCabe um, you know within the private confines of, of the O'Higgins Commission so she needs to clarify that in some shape or form but Jonathan the O'Higgins report suggests implies that on Garda Siakona needs radical, radical root and branch reform. And do we have confidence in those who will carry out that reform if those people approve of or are, are aware of Garda man hours, taxpayers' money being used to destroy the person who highlights the wrongdoing in the first place? That's why it's important. It's because we have a toxic culture Uh, a toxic public discourse here that vilifies whistleblowers, vilifies people who speak truth to power. And this isn't about, you know, Dunn Stores or Tesco or... This is about the administration of justice in Ireland. This is the latest in a series of 19 reports, no less than 19 reports in Dungarda Garda Siakana since since 2013. We've lost commissioners. We've lost ministers for justice. They need to be absolutely explicit about whether or not they approve of state assets, taxpayers' money being used to destroy people who uncover wrongdoing and fatal flaws, fatal flaws in our police. Okay, look, Jonathan, we've come through the Celtic and the, the ethical and intellectual failures of the Celtic Tiger. Imagine if we'd had whistleblowers in financial services, banking, regulatory. We wouldn't have the awful austerity measures that have inflicted suffering on the most vulnerable people in Ireland. Ireland needs whistleblowers. Uh, we still await uh, further statements from the Guard Commissioner Dorian O'Sullivan in relation to just what was said to her council uh, at that stage in the tribunal. Ireland needs whistleblowers. Ireland needs whistleblowers.